Hey everybody, welcome back. Hope you're doing well today. We are back with good old Gladius once again. And uh, we're, we're having a questionable time. A questionable time. Well, no, actually, I'm having a great time. But my space marines, my imperial fists, space... Say so, <laughs> words. Space marines are having a very, very questionable time. So, where do we leave it last episode? We've got a second fortress now at the front here. Of course, we've got this one as well. We've got all three of our resources in the area fortressed up. We do still have our captain. We've got two tactical squads. In here is our assault space marines that we have remaining. Just the one. Two tactical squads. We've got both of our scouts still. And then we've got one predator battle tank. And we've got one unit of Devastator Space Marines. And of course, a very beat up Razorback. Not that that's doing a whole ton. We have actually finished this turn, haven't we? What have we got coming? We have got more Devastators coming in nine turns. So not any time too soon. Ah, look at this. I didn't notice that last time, did I? We, uh, we're we about to cap out. We're about to finish another refectory. And then we're going to need more population. So that dictates what we're going to do next. Well, bugger. I wanted to do some other things, but that's too bad. We need more pop. No problem. And we do have another Predator coming out in two turns. And a Librarian in three turns. Although it's going to be very underleveled compared to our, our Orcish enemy. Dreadnought in five turns. We really need to crank up the tech tree after what happened last episode. We have got to get some much stronger units out. We've got to try and get some of these upgrades as well for our existing units. To give us a real fighting chance. Let's end the turn. And let's just get back into the swing of it, shall we? I mean... I still don't know what they're doing. I feel we do have to... Are these bloody things still? I should really kill them, shouldn't I? I feel we still have to kind of hold the line. Right, so yeah, 13 required, 13 pop is currently what we have. I do not have the requisition to actually build that. We're going to have to wait a turn. Uh, I could claim a tile, but I won't. We'll just wait. And then we'll build the pop building. Uh, I guess on the same tile as the other one, that'll be fine. The fact that we're trying to get up the research tree, I'm just thinking, maybe we ought to pump a couple of uh, librarians out. Where would those be? Well, I'm just not about filling that slot, aren't I? Uh, give me the city. Yeah. So not there. Um, requisitions are here. We could maybe get the, like, this tile. And might not be a bad shout and just put some research on it. Because we've just got to get ahead somehow. We are really, really struggling. So do, are we ending turn here without doing anything? I kind of want to find out what's going on. Bear in mind we lost our scout bikes. That would have been handy. We um, but I could... We what we got here? Ready. They're not here. What is your command? Ahead. Bear in mind we don't really need the scout ability on cooldown. I'm just going to use it again. Actually, no, that doesn't really tell me much. I'll take it back. I'll take it back. You sit tight. The problem is, if they do roll up, we're very, going to have to very quickly run away. And we might... <laughs> these guys can get absolutely deleted by the Gorgonaut. I am really... I would love to be able to see their point of view. I hear aggressive tank noises. Fantastic. What do you require? I require another Predator Battle Tank. Maybe we ought to take that out, you know? The, uh, the Imperial Bastion there. We should really be doing something useful. Let's just shift you over here. So we have a bit more vision without being quite as far forward. Although we don't have good vision, actually. Maybe you do need to shift forward one. It's not great, but then you can get much better vision. Actually, not much better. I take it back. I guess it was just the scout that gave us good, good vision. I could nick that trader encampment back. But yeah, taking that out might be worth our while. And I kind of need to expand. Like, I wonder what this is. Uh, is that the the loyalty uh, weed thing? That might be worth a go. We, we probably need to just go and do some useful stuff, don't we? And we could. I'm not sure how I... All right, well, let's settle for a sec. What are we doing? We really need the pot building. I mean, ideally, you'd put it on here, though. In fact, why don't I put it on here? Because there's no bonuses here. And then we'll put... Uh, uh, why don't we? We can put a research building there straight away if we want to. So we don't have enough requisitions to get another vehicle straight away. Librarian in one turn. Do I dare move this predator back? What do you I think I do. And can you... You can't see that, right? Not yet. 
We'll just wait there. I might just use the two predators and destroy this and then maybe move up there and claim that. We're away off having another fortress, obviously. Uh, oh, but, oh, I say that, but don't forget there are those those bad boys in there. The Umbras. What is your will? Ooh, what is my will? Why are you blue? Uh, are, are Imperial Fist Librarians blue? Let's move you forward for a bit more. Coordinates received. Is that normal? I mean, he's got the he's got the shoulder plate on. I guess it is. Right then, Chief. Yeah, wh whatever that is. Uh, curses the ranged weaponry of a target enemy unit. Also deals damage if the target is a vehicle or fortification. So that's actually pretty good. It means that whenever they fire their weapon, they take damage. And we do damage to them if they are a vehicle or fortification. Shockwave. Uh, is it just an area of effect? It seems to be. 1.7 damage. Range 1. Radius 1 tile. I'm pretty sure it's just a, a damage all around him. Does it hit allies? I assume not. And levitate. Flies across obstacles to the target tile. I think I might go for the curse. First of all. Um, so we do have a bolt pistol. We do have a force stave. Concussive. Temporarily reduce the accuracy of the target infantry unit. Only one range. 12 hit points. 8 armor. We're not exactly that tanky. But yeah, let's pick... Oh, have we got... We're level 4. So actually we can get two of those. And the shockwave. Do I want levitate? Maybe. You never know. To be honest, you never know. Um, where is it that you can usually fire at that bloody thing from? Here? Or is it here? One, two. It is there. Why don't we have a go? Are you spotting for this now? No. I need to... Uh, yeah, apparently you can see it from there. Let's destroy it. We'll just hold in the meantime. I'm actually going to move you forward a smidge. Risky, but... And we'll just keep an eye out. I know this is like super not high octane gameplay, but we have got to be careful. Let's put you to sleep there. We do need some more requisitions for the time being. We are getting 30 a turn. It's not too bad. It could be better, of course. I really don't want to push up and aggravate another another civilization and our problems wouldn't be any different with someone else we bring destruction to the enemy. i mean you could actually use uh that <laughs> on this fortification to be honest uh we do have 88 do we want to i guess we want another predator though we don't really want a scout by core razorback it feels like a waste of requisitions i mean i want the actually dreadnought in one turn what am i saying what am I saying? Dreadnought in one turn. If only we hadn't lost a couple of key units. This would feel better. So, heavy walker unit. Here we go. Whole bunch of upgrades and stuff we can get. For the time being, not a whole ton going on. Walker, so movement penalty in forests and imperial ruins are, are reduced. And jolly good. So, how much does that bad boy cost? Uh, only 90 as well. Fine. 10 turns. Again, we really do want to try and get more armories built, but as you <laughs> as you can see, there's like so many so many things we really would love to have. We could get the Devastator Centurions. We still haven't got the veteran um, groups, you know, the Assault Marines and the Tactical Marines there. Orbital Strike could be huge. Combat Shield would be good, but and we only have one Assault Space Marine right now. The Healing Unit would be good. It's all good. Extra infantry armor for all infantry is magnificent. I think maybe we go for the, ob or the orbital? The orbital strike. And if we really wanted to, we could then push on. And I mean, getting the hunter might be useful. But we could go for the thunderfire cannon. Long range fire support is going to be big. Vindicate a heavy tank unit with devastating close range cannon. Get a dozer blade for our predator. Reducing movement penalties. Okay, there's a lot we could do. But let's let's get the orbital strike. Right, chaps, can we uh, destroy that? Let's just move in a bit. We'll have a look. If we have to, we'll bring reinforcements. Are you... You're almost healed up. I'm tempted to chase the uh, chase the waspy boys with you. 
Uh, maybe some scouts as well, although I don't really want to take them off the front line. We stand ready. Why don't we, next turn, just chase down those stupid wasps and get rid of them? Okay, are we ready to just carry on? Yeah, we're still waiting on that. We've now got stuff in production. Power-wise, we're going to run out. We've got such a big stockpile, I'm not too worried. Oh my goodness, the Renegade Imperial Guard have been defeated. <laughs> we're going to have to play another game where we actually see them. Might do a 1v1 or something with another race against the Renegade Imperial Guard. We didn't even get to look at them. They just got deleted. I mean, it's partly my fault for crying in a corner and then just losing to the Orcs. But there you go. Right. Yeah. Armed and ready, huh? Oh, we did good damage. Excellent. I mean, to be fair, we do have the Kraken Bolts upgrade. Right, we've got to be a bit careful. Uh, you could, yeah, go there. All right. Leapfrog. In the forest. Okay, there's that little son of a gun. How are you doing? You're healed. Let's just, let's just stick you. Uh, Let's just stick you here for now. Obviously got the jump pack to help us get around if we need it. Nothing to really do there. It's kind of weird having one city, isn't it? And I am a huge noob in managing it. I think it really punishes you for not prioritizing. Oh, a space slip. That's annoying. We've gone for the Overwatch fire. Uh, five damage? Four damage? Okay, that's not bad. Well, you're going to get hit by that, but it won't do much. We could bring the Devastators over to help. Maybe we clear these out. Saying that, the Devastators have just shot them. We're looking pretty good here. We're going to take a bit of pointless damage. Anything going to happen here? What is your nope. Will? My lord. My lord. Alright, we should be good here, shouldn't we? We can go right up and finish the job. Just get rid of them. Stop them flitting around. And we'll just heal you up that small amount of damage you took. Right. Um, are you heavy? Yeah, reduced accuracy after moving. I think I'll still move you up. We've got 40 health. You should be all right. Now, they're probably going to bring reinforcement bad boys here. So I am going to start bringing the devastators over. We've left ourselves a little bit thin here, but I'm not going to push out the trees. We shouldn't get found. We're going to hang out the librarian for now. Here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can chill. Um, although, to be honest, there's no no real harm in moving forward to the edge of the forest, just in case suddenly something comes this way. And I suppose that's it then, isn't it? Two turns till the next group of Devastators. Would be good to get the next um, type of infantry up. Death Watch have been defeated as well. Dude. Everyone's dying. This is turning into a really weird 1v1. This was not my intention. They've died really quickly. Right, we've got full strength clowns here. We should be able to hose that one down quite a lot, though. These guys haven't moved, so they'll do decent damage. Uh, is there any mileage in? Oh my god, the librarian does nothing to it. Absolutely nothing. Does have that. But basically nothing. So you may as well chill. Uh, you can come over. Why not? You move quickly. And we'll take you guys back up to the front line. But yeah, my, my kingdom for full map vision right now. Would absolutely love to see what's happening. Okay, this is worrying. We've got mechs here. We're going to hit them with the overwatch fire. Actually did a ton of damage. But we are gonna have to scoot pretty soon and i've just opened into combat with these guys one runs away how much damage are you gonna do 6.7 it's quite a lot they are a pain we'll be okay though um i can finish this unit which i think we should it does put us a little bit in danger i don't really feel comfortable moving these guys forward either to support the scouts um i could but it doesn't feel good and put you in that brush there. We're just going to try and hold that line. Right. 
Right, right, right. Is there anything I want to do? I mean, we can do damage there. We might as well. Oh, he doesn't do any damage then. Of course, it's just cursed it, but that's fine. Nice thing about big units is when they take damage, they don't lose any firepower compared to when, like, infantry units or whatever lose models. Unfortunately, we don't quite get the kill, uh, but what we can do is come up here and finish it. And we need to kill these. We can't have them keep running around. All right. Okay, another group of Devastators. Let's get them to our front line in this very strange 1v1. Um, are we just getting more Devastators? We do have quite a lot of requisitions now. I think we just have to keep pumping these out, don't we? It seems kind of weird. And we could probably do with some more Assault Space Marines. But honestly, I think this is going to be the most effective thing for us at the moment. Get a few level ups there, which is great. Okay, now a lot of units are probably going to come out of the darkness here. Yeah, and we're going to get attacked. And you didn't fire Overwatch there? Did they not trigger Overwatch or something? Anyway, this unit's dead if anything else can reach. No, we're okay. But we do need to bounce. Um, can you... Yeah, you can run that far back. Our faith is our shield. I'm glad that your faith is your shield, but... That's a little bit annoying. I really wanted to not commit any more troops in that direction. I think what we do is we... Sit there. Probably the Devastator's behind for now. And we'll commit the razor back to get the kill. You should be able to get it from two tiles away. Yeah. We've got some other friends over there. I'm not too worried. We're going to sit this tank here. The librarian. I'm not sure how much use you're really going to get, but let's go over. Try and get these devastators up. Obviously, that Imper Im Imperial? Imperial Bastion is gone, so that's something. Orbital Strike would be great right now. We haven't done the Doctrine. Uh, maybe we will. We've got plenty of influence. We can actually... Well, we could afford, before I did all that stuff, an extra captain. I'm not really sold on the captain right now. Are you going to do something really silly and annoying? No, you're going away. Okay. Okay, we, see, we get it. We get it. Let's see what the orcs do. Nothing? Scout? Aha, uh -huh. not nothing. Okay. We've got to be careful because if we overextend, we're in a really bad spot. But, similarly, we need to try and do what damage we can. Bloody mega knobs. I think we can kill... Have you got Overwatch fire then with this? Well, yeah, but no, but you've been shot, right? So... 5.6. Oh, no, we do take Overwatch Fire. That's annoying. Although we didn't actually take much damage at all from it. So we will use the... What's it called? Power Strike. Which gets them kind of low. If I moved up, I would do more damage. How do I feel? I think we do. Oh, it's two. How much is this? One. So it is literally double damage. It's still not great, to be honest. I hope for more. Which is a bit silly, because there was never going to be any more. We can move these guys up. They actually do do really good damage. We could maybe get the kill, but I don't want to overcommit for it. Oh, you can fire from there. That'll do it. Yeah, between the two of you. Okay, well, let's find out. Oh, you need to move to fire? Oh, sugar, you need to move there, didn't you? What a donkey. That ruins all of my plans. Would love that. Shard of all. Uh, oh, man. Let's back up for now. Uh, you can't really do a damn thing. So the only option is to commit this tactical squad. Which probably... 
I don't see any other units, but you know how this goes. We'd have to go right up there to kill the unit. You know how this goes. It goes this way every time. I could move them up. Even they can't fire from there, though. Oh, and it's this unit, which isn't here yet. Uh, oh, gosh. Uh, oh, oh. No, you can't reach. What am I even saying? I don't want to lose this tactical squad. And you just know there's going to be more units. But look how close that is to dying. One HP. It's going to escape. But I think we have to let it go. Like, genuinely. We've been burned too many times. Okay, what are we doing here? Is it time to get the armory rolling? I think it is. I think we get a second armory here. I know that we've got power shortages. I think it is what it is. So yeah, we're going to let that go. Because I really don't know what else is coming. In fact, there's some boys there. We did fire already, so no overwatch fire. And yeah, look, we would have probably been smothered if we'd gone in there. I actually think we probably back up. Well, we might be all right with these. It depends where that, that big boy is. You know? We've already scouted. I could maybe sit tight. I'm kind of wishing I moved you over here. I think I will. Let's get you over there. I'm probably going to... Is the librarian useful here? I'm actually going to put him at the front. Risks be damned. And I think I'm going to keep you there for now as a, as a backup. In fact, no, I'm not going to keep you there as a backup. I'm going to keep you a bit closer so that you can jump pack a little bit further in. Right. Oh, we don't do good damage to infantry with this thing, do we? Tank busters are going to be a priority, to be fair. So I think we try and disintegrate that unit as much as we can from a safe distance. We are the chapters armored Ra. I could kill the unit. And it's only, I mean, it's one step over. But again, we're then leaving the forest. It is a risk. What is your command? If I swap you two, I can't really do that safely. Oh, to be fair, we can go one tile forward into the woods. Yeah, there you go, look. That's what happens. Fire there. Oh, Overwatch from both? Are you serious? Take out that unit. I feel like ugh, we kind of have to commit there. It's not pretty. Speak. I will listen. We can curse them, but it doesn't really do a ton. Um, we can't attack. We could... I mean, at this point, there isn't too much worry about being in cover. That wouldn't kill them, though. What is your command? We wouldn't kill them. Ready How far can you jump combat. pack? Not that far, actually. What's going on there? Is the target always crossed out like that, or am I just crazy? Yes, my lord. It's not showing a range or anything. Oh, I moved you this turn. <laughs> Dumbass. You got no points. My lord. Okay. We stand ready. Is that how is that for a commitment? It's not the worst. It's not the best. I'm gonna I risk it. Um and then we nearly kill this unit. And then I don't know. I mean I could commit the librarian, he'd hundred percent just get killed by the Gorgonaut, wouldn't he? No, he already used his movement as well. I'm being really stupid. We haven't done that. Just do that. Just curse them. It means if they do attack, they'll die. That's as good as we can really offer at the moment. You guys have moved. Nothing really going on here. We're not going to get another librarian. Okay, let's let's have a bad turn. Imagine if we've just watched like all the other AI empires die off screen. And then we just die straight away. Alright, that guy's on low health. And I think we reach him, right? He's dead. Mega knobs are dead. Maybe. Oh, hello. Oh, in fact, that's going for the kill. Which is kind of annoying because it's stealing my XP. But 
Whatever. An orc unit dead is fine. Right, what I'm concerned about. My lord. Speak. I will listen. What I am concerned about oh, is the uh, the Gorgonaut. Because if that comes into the forest, because I can't really see, wherever it comes in, somebody's dead. I think I will move up here with my assault boys. What is your will? All right. We're going to sit tight. We're going to sit tight. We're all sitting tight. I mean, to be honest, I think we kill that thing. I need level ups. I need experience. I need things dead. You're going to sit tight. I think pretty much everyone else is going to hold position. Nice little overwatch arc. I could move you up. And do reasonable damage, but I think I'm going to hold. Let them come to us if that's what it's going to be. I don't know why I keep checking this every turn, even though nothing's changed. Two turns, we'll have our Dreadnought. Three turns, we'll have Orbital Strike. Yeah, here they all come, look. We'll take some Overwatch fire. Flash gets have 33 health. How filthy is that, man? They're so strong. They've good armor pen as well. Let's have a look. Uh, we actually did okay there. We are in the forest. We took 3.8 damage. And we heard a lot of movement from bad boys. Three health on that. And what? Three health on that as well. What a bait. Oh, go on. Attack them. Go on, son. Go on. Nice. We'll take any damage you've got. No, don't attack me. That's not part of the deal. You just wasted my overwatch, although we don't really need it, I suppose. You're going to attack me. Well, that's shit, isn't it? Attack the orcs, you jerks. Only the orcs. We're the good guys. There are no good guys in 40k, by the way. <laughs> right. We can kill that unit. 3.8. 7.9. We've got to be far in there. Uh... Okay. To be fair, you can't reach anyone else, so kill that unit. I think we do just commit here. Do a good chunk of damage. Uh, we do have a fortress, you know. I'm tempted to drop it in here, literally just to kind of deflect fire and be a pain in the ass. If you fired, yeah. So all, all you three are fired. You have not. I probably will fire at these, do we think? What is that? Go away. I think we kind of have to. So yeah, I'm going to drop a fortress next to this resource. It's not going to do much, but it's going to be there. Oh, fucking hell. <laughs> I see. <laughs> Overwatch fire comes in. So we got... These flash kits, we've got more flash kits behind, we've got boys, we've got killer cans, we've got the war bus. I think what we should be doing what is, your will? is pulling back. As you, you know? My lord. As one into the gathering storm. Yes. Let me see here. I don't want you not in forest cover. I think I kind of have to. Because I want you guys what back you here. Command? It's kind of bad. But it is what it is. So do I take that f that, that shot? I suppose I do. Oh, Orbital strike two turns. We have fired a lot of our troops. So this is going to get really messy now. We could lose. Like No, no joke. We could just lose. If we lose the game, I'm going to make another game <laughs> and uh, and try again. There's the Gorgonaut. Gork Anor. It's not Gorgonaut. Sorry. Gorgonaut. I don't really have a good answer for that just now. Who's this? Oh, it's Killer Cans. This is going to hurt. Oh, you're Overwatch firing as well. This is great, but it would be better if we could kill one model, but we haven't. Oh, we should then. Maybe. Did we kill one model? I think we did. There's only two left. At least we reduce the damage. It's still a ton. They're all going to just blow this up. How do we feel? Do we have to retreat? They've got a lot. 
This war boss is going to do a ton of damage. Probably going to kill this unit, right? Yep. That's a unit gone. Holy cow. Oh, you're not helping. Don't. Yeah, good. Just don't. Oh, is there an enemy there? Okay, good. I'd really rather you were over here doing something. This is not good. Please stop. I think we're just going to have to run away from there. Um, we're kind of needed on this side anyway. I don't really want to be mucking around with these neutral guys. So we're going to pull you back. And we're going to pull you back as well. I think we leave you there. Right. What do you the war boss. Talk to me. We can't really do a lot about that. It's pretty rough, isn't it? We can kill one of the... Actually, are there two killer cans, not three? Yeah. I feel like it's only... Yeah, I think I've got that wrong. What is your will? Um... This is difficult, isn't it? Uh, I want you to do this, but you're going to have range here. You should do, right? We're going to risk it because it'll be useful. Yeah. I will crush them. Go on. That's done good damage. And now do we kill it with this? Looks like it. We're so screwed with that. Don't forget, well, our fortress is now gone. My Lord. And I don't really know what we do except shoot the war boss and hope for the best. Uh, I could move you up, but that's basically yes. death. I think the captain's probably dead. Unless I run away. You're not firing at anything, but I don't really want to move you. I can't really move you guys. It doesn't it doesn't help enough. Um, we can bring you out. And we can shoot the war boss. I suppose we do. But we're not going to do enough damage. And we're going to be in a lot of trouble. Um, I mean, I could move back and maybe we get away with it. What do we think? I can bring him down to half health, but I think we still die. I don't want to keep running away, to be honest with you. But at the same time, if we lose the whole game because of this, it's a bit rough, isn't it? Can you reach him with these? No. You can slow down the war boss. <laughs> it costs 60 influence to throw some bowlers. Oh my goodness. That is going to come in and just kill me, isn't it? I'm really unsure how to play this. Whether it's worth doing damage to that or not. If we don't do damage, you're going to come and kill my scouts. I think I'm just going to have to take it on the chin. Or try. But we are in a lot of bother. Oh my god, here's the big boy. What a guy. What a guy. 40 health, 8 armor. He's got Hammer of Wrath. And we've got a power fist. We've got a multi melter range two. Armor pen eight, which is pretty big. Increases the armor penetration at half. Pretty spicy. And a storm bolter as well. Let's try and get another one out. <laughs> we do have a second armory on the way in five turns. I am deeply concerned about this game right now. I think that's it, isn't it? Um, you, you haven't fired, so we might as well do more damage. I am deeply concerned about how this turn's going to play out. It's kind of a hide behind your hands moment. The war boss runs away, which is something. I wonder how much damage you do to a predator. And what if they just go in on the predator? That predator could be dead. Okay, good. Good. We kill a couple of models. One model. Bringing it down to seven health. Can you fire? Did you already fire? I wasn't really paying attention enough. No. Oh, we're not quite going to get it. Down to four health. We haven't quite got the over. Oh, we do! Oh, we've done it. That's huge. I didn't. I forgot about you guys. My bad. Good kill. Oh, God. Everything's happening. Right. We've got flash kits over here. We've got tank busters there. And that is the big boy, I think. Is it? 12 damage? No, it was tank busters. That's the big boy. Eviscerates my scouts. Level 6 scouts deleted from the game. What are we going to do? Do we just try and fight it out? Maybe we do. 
I don't want to spend a whole series cowering away, you know? Should we just give it a go? And if we lose... Well, it won't be the end of the campaign immediately. Orbital Strike comes in. It does nothing. It sucks. It doesn't suck, but it sucks. Maybe on these guys, to be honest. Let's hold it for now. Let's hold it for now. We have targets here. It's crap, though. It's crap. We really need to be attacking that. All right, we've got to get around there. Uh, we can actually run you in. You will take Overwatch fire from everything under the sun. I think this is the play. No, I'm going to run you in. I don't really care about you that much. No, Overwatch? Okay. We're not going to get the kill here. We did level up. Oh, the oh, you have an orbital strike from your ultimate. It doesn't do that much, but it does. If we we can literally delete this unit, which honestly I'll take it. That might be the play or the tank busters. But I think this is better. I wonder if we can use both. Does this cost influence to use? I don't think so. It's multiple group members of this target unit. We can use both. It's cheesy, but I'm here for it. Oh, we don't kill them, which is a bit sad. How much damage do you do? Enough, right? I don't know whether it is it more value to do more damage to this unit. I don't think so. Okay, we've busted all our influence. Uh, this only has one turn cooldown, but it costs 120 influence. So we've, we've burned through all that, which we have to bear in mind. We can't bring down a fortress unless we have 210 influence because it scales. How do we feel about you? Do we just get stuck in? Maybe. 3.9 damage. That does the same. We might as well save the grenade. Um, so we will go in and do basically nothing. No? Did you already attack? You already... Oh, you used orbital strike. Of course you did. What an umpty. Okay. Right. For realsies, if you get up close, you can kill that, right? Let's kill what we can. Kill what we can. We can do some damage there. Is Shockwave better? Damage 1.7? You wouldn't have thought so, would you? Poor Librarian's just going to get absolutely destroyed. But let's kill the other units, man. What can we do? We can move you over to get... To maybe get the kill. Let's just confirm. Let's kill this. The Librarian may be targeted. It's kind of okay. Smite them down, bro. Mark them down, brothers. Okay. Can you can you get the kill without getting too close? Yes. You are vulnerable. I mean, to be honest, this guy probably still kills you, but all the same. We keep going. Okay, we've wiped out most of the stuff. We have the boys. Oh, I have no solution for this man. It's not a man, I realize. Uh, like, somebody's dead. Probably this guy. If not, we use that. You need to get your get your bum moving, sir. And is that it? Have we all been? Yeah, we have, haven't we? We've been we've been busy this turn. So we're going to lose another unit, I think. What is your will? I mean, losing the scouts isn't the worst. I mean, we're keeping these at the moment, the, the higher damage, although they are just armor piercing. In terms of infantry counters, we're going to be struggling. What do we do? We get? Oh no, I don't think apothecaries is worth it. Extra armor might be worth it, but I think maybe the devastated centurions. Let's give that a go. Eleven turns. We could come up here. We could get the the vindicator tank. We could get the thunderfire cannon. Long range support would be really, really good. But I think I want to get a better infantry option just now. I think that's the play. We're still in this. We're still in this. Okay. Right. Let's see what, who he kills. <laughs> We'll see what the orc boys do. He goes for the librarian who survives with two health, but there are more tank busters here. Have they just moved, though? If they've moved, we can evacuate. It seems like they've already moved. We could actually... Oh, no. Never mind. War boss. Rip. Bye-bye, librarian. You tried. There's always more. Always more orcs. Okay. They took both of them to kill the librarian. We could get another one. But it's going to be... No, actually, we have no influence now. Oh, don't. 
You are such a pain in the ass, man. What do you mean? Just get out of my life. Okay. What do we do here? I think we have to focus the war boss with both of these, to be honest. Uh, it's kind of annoying because the old old naughty boy is just going to be killing everyone. But what can I do? I could come here if that's better. All right, let's. Um, we're going to ignore these tank busters for now. Let's do that. Come on, man. I need you. All right. Can you kill it between you? I mean, if worse comes to worse, I might have to move forward. That's definitely what I want to do with you. Oh, he's so close. Look at that. It's fucking disgusting. Uh, is there a less shit way for me to get this done? Not really. Uh, think. Uh, well, yeah, I could do that, can't I? Oh, he still doesn't kill him, though. Does that? Shit. I mean, I can do... I can move forward, but then this unit's dead. I mean, we've got... Uh, was there another unit here? I can't remember. What is your command? Doesn't really tell me anything. Uh, we do have you, though. Oh, hold on. Okay, let's do it like this. It's not great, but let's do it like this. And don't forget, this unit can still get deleted by them. But... Good. At least the war boss out of the way. I think you're definitely just attacking here. I'm going to move you forward partially for vision. Although, do I need... Who, who do I need where? We cannot get line of sight on this asshole. Are you serious that you can't fire at him from there? No, that is so garbage. It's because there's a... Well, no, you should... Oh, it's just too much forest, man. Okay. Okay. Uh, this Razorback dies if it gets hit. Is that a bit of a waste? Maybe. There's only tank busters over here. I think what I'm going to do is move that forward for scouting purposes and look what we found. Holy crap. So that unit's obviously dead, but this is kind of what I wanted to find out. We're going to get hit by every... This is probably dead already. This flash gets here. I can't kill all this, man. Not now. We could back off with what we have. But you've already attacked, which is pretty bad. And you've already you're already stuck here. Yes. It might not be a bad shout to move back though. Like for real. Come on. Let's regroup over here. Oh, uh, yeah, you're fucked, dude. <laughs> um, if you want to... I don't know. Uh, you can't even kill a single flash gear. Why don't you attack this big mech? Don't let your, your memes be dreams or something. Two turns, we have some more devastators. We kind of need some, some normal squads out. And this is where getting the veterans would be great. We're a long way off the centurions. Oops, Daisy. We'll be able to get vehicles out quicker very soon because we're getting a second armory. But anyway, let's see what the damage is here. More killer cans. Oh my Christ. Do you reckon the orcs have killed everyone? Do you reckon? They probably have. I think we have to back up. Because they're now coming for us, big style. Wait, where did the where did the big boy go? Hello? Oh, man. Okay. Predator waiting for prey. Our duty calls. What's your range, my guy? Range two, range one. Okay. Devastator reporting. We're retreating. We stand ready. As one into the gathering storm. Let's get you that buff. Unyielding. We could do good damage there, but I think we just need to back up and not lose all these units because they are coming full force right now uh we're gonna lose these fortresses which is pretty bad what do you command you could heal one hit point i'm not gonna do it although what's the cooldown three turns now we'll save it you never know 
You never know. Okay. We should do reasonable damage here. Right? If everybody commits. Uh, oh, the Devastators are out of range. That's a shame. Another war boss. We got some war buggies. This is going to be a slog. We really need... We need to really be... Okay, you're on the wire weed. Well played. We need to be really effective with our units. Unfortunately, we're not going to have a lot of... We're going to lose ground. We've got some more trees here. More Devastators is helpful. Can you guys kill this? I think you can. Oh, look how fucking disgustingly close that is. Dude, no. You can't do that to me. It, they can. Uh, okay. I think... It sucks because we're going to lose all of our overwatch, but I think we have to commit there. What do you command? Emperor, guide me. My service is eternal. I know it is, but I need you just to chill for now. We stand ready. Just damage whatever you can. Keep attacking those tank busters. Right, should we get some normal marines out? 60 requisition. Or maybe scouts. Do we get more scouts? Range is kind of big right now. I think I'm going to get scouts. At least one group. Goodness. Never had such a hard game. I mean, it is on very hard. And I'm a terrible Space Marine player. But, uh, wow. You know? Fa oh, faction discovered the tower arrive into the mix. I do not have Overwatch fire. Oh, hello there. Piranhas coming in. We need to we need to back up, man. Straight up. We need to back up. This is bad. This is bad. Let's get you over there to to uh, run interference. Let's get the dreadnought at the front. That's it. That's it. We are going to do a bit of a retreat here. <laughs> and we're going to go into our defensive shell. It looks like the orcs. What are they doing, though? Are they backing off? Don't do that to me. Please commit. This is the only time I want you to commit in the whole game. Don't do that to me. Right. What do we build? We need a power station. We do have that available. It's not a huge rush job if we want to get... Another, so we've got 13 production on the armory now. So this costs uh, 63. So how much is that? Brain, brain engaged. Uh, 39 would be three turns. 42, 52. So it's like five turns. Is that right? Oh my God, it wasn't that hard to work out, was it? Yeah, it's like five turns to get one of these. I don't know why I didn't just do like five times 13 and then see how close it was. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it's like five turns. It's still not brilliant. Do you reckon we could chunk them out quicker? If we got yet another armory. I'm tempted. But then we still need... We need infantry as well. So I'm not against maybe grabbing the Apothecarian. Let's do it. I need that orbital relay, you know. Kind of now. But we never went for it. Okay. Let's see what the tower do before we leave it for today. Okay, good. Engaging with greens. Ah, oh, actually, no, that's probably neutrals. Okay, we've still got some green skins here. Just can't see them in the woods. Oh, my. Was that green skins? It sounded like green skins. Getting their drones out. I would love to see what you're firing at, sir. Looks like the drones are coming over, which is kind of annoying, but they will just get destroyed by Overwatch fire, I'm sure. Only two damage. Will that hurt them? <laughs> Having more scouts will definitely help for things like that. Just overwatch fire on lightly armoured stuff. This could get really messy here. <laughs> if the Tau just... we This might be an entirely defensive game. I really want to see how well this does. Not from there, but from up close. But... 
We can't, we can't screw around here. You know, we just need to, uh, let's put you, let me think, you there, you there, you there, you there. All right. What else we got? Everybody else just chill. We literally just got to wait and see how this plays out to an extent. We can do our doctrine, but I kind of want influence now because we can use orbital strike. So we're going to hold it. I'm aware that I need to end the episode. We're just going to go one more turn because <laughs> I want to see what's happening. Just want to see. Yes, they are fighting the orcs. Okay, Tau. Hopefully that baits you into bringing the rest of your army over because you've just brought piranhas over, which are just fast skimmer units with anti-armor weaponry. It looks like you're coming. Oh, no, you're going over there. Okay. Why did you suddenly die? Are you cursed from me? Did I curse them? I don't know. I really want to see this dreadnought in action, but we got to chill. We've got to. We can't. All right. Orbital strike, though, which is free. No influence. It's on a five turn cooldown. We're just going to keep using it. Um, we can't see them in there anymore. So screw you guys. Take damage. All right. Everyone else. So how many? We've got three Devastators. We've got one Scout. So we're building another Scout. We've got one Dreadnought. Another Dreadnought's about to pop out. And we've got a couple of Predators. If we can get these Devastator Centurions, that'll be great. That's four turns away. Scouts are five turns. So that's fine. So we know what we're going to build next from there. It's just a question of whether we keep pumping out Dreadnoughts or not. The Predator... We kind of need a mix of, of Dreadnoughts and Predators, I think. However, I'm hoping the Dreadnoughts hold the front line fairly reasonably. They're not that strong. They're not that strong. Um, infantry armor might be good, especially if we are getting these Devastator Centurions out here. Do you know what we need, though? We need the Thunderfire Cannon. Because it's going to be range 3 as well, <laughs> probably. <laughs> Everything range 3. Bolter Drill, maybe. Accuracy of all bolt weapons, that's going to be big. Oh, we just need everything. Terminators, heavily armored infantry unit that can take on virtually every ground opponent. I can't tell you how much we need to get that. We need to rush that, maybe. And maybe I should be building more research buildings so we can try and get there. That's going to be a big one. I mean, getting all these extra upgrades for our for our units, so that's, that affects predators and stuff as well. And fortresses of redemption. Stuff like that's going to be huge. Uh, land raider tanks. Ugh, yeah. Storm Raven gunship. We get gunships. We'll be in business. And then we can get some other stuff down here. We really need upgrades. And we just need as many good units. Oh, we need these veterans. Oh, we need everything, man. We need everything. One more turn. One more turn. Last turn. I, pr I promise. Last turn. Last turn. I really want to see this Dreadnought in action. But I think we're going to have to wait until next time. I don't want to go out there and just get completely surrounded. I know we're playing super defensive. But we got to try and win this game. We have got to try and like power up and win this game. Um, uh, don't forget also, Tau units could just come flying out of there at any moment. Things are getting sweaty. So are we going to pump out another Dreadnought? We've got two and we've got two Predators. I think I am going to get another one because these are going to be our front liners for the time being. And we've got Devastators and Predators behind. We've already got three Devastators. There's just not that many tiles at, at range. We're going to have to get stuck in. All right. We're going to have to leave it there. I know we didn't get to see the Dreadnought. I know yet another attempt at offensive failed miserably. I know the interesting factions have lost the game already. <laughs> but we're still in this and I'm still going to try and grind out a win because it's just so much fun. All right. So as always, everybody, thank you very much for watching. Have yourself a fantastic day and I will see you in the next episode.